Well, here we are, uh, where the walk starts on Sunday night, uh, six o'clock. Uh, appropriately enough, uh, what happened here, which is why you see all this pitting behind me on the pillars uh, and the lower stone courses. Um, in December 1940, they put an auxiliary water tank in this area and of course if fires were started uh, the fire service had got a handy reservoir of water. What better to site it in the former medieval Barker's Pool. So anyhow the Luftwaffe appears as a visit uh, and a parachute mine, I think it's a parachute mine which is a curious bit of ordnance a naval, uh, a naval weapon, I understand, that drifts down uh, and goes off with a tremendous bang in the area in the foreground here. And of course, as it happens, it falls in the water tank, so the blast is contained. Uh, but as you can see on the pillars here, heck of, heck of a lot of shrapnel damage. Also, some uh, in the middle foreground. Uh, the base of the cenotaph and um, wars do leave scars they leave scars in people or on people uh, and within people and here there's scars of war on buildings uh, but um, there's an incredible photograph of the steps here and it's like you know the mythical titan the giants have been playing dominoes and one of the titans has got a bad hand and he's thrown his dominoes away and all these steps are, are all over the place so it indicates the effects of the explosion in here in the city hall after the blitz they got police units and fire units from all over Yorkshire and I, I believe Lancashire as well uh, and when they've been when they were able to get a bit of rest then they fed them in there and they'd have a fag in there and a cup of tea in there and of course the wad, the sandwich, it'd probably be bully beef on the issue of bully beef and, uh, but again it's, uh, you know, it's keep calm and carry on uh, stiff up a lip, you know uh, not only not only as amplified in those war films, which is war films of the 50s, you know, Richard Totten and Ambusters, but ordinary people, get on with it. My father never talked about the Blitz much, about, only about walking home over broken glass and dodging bomb craters and stuff to try and find out what happened to my mother. And my mother only said how she hated the Banshee, well that's my, that's my word, the Banshee wail of the, of the sirens, she hated it. Uh, and again, you know, like I said before, uh, they've got some, well, the Spanish, the Spanish call them cuchons, uh, basically balls. Uh, and that's what Sheffield has had in those days. Uh, and I'm sure we've got it today as well. <laughs>